All right, guys, so this is the infamous Pedroia warm up series. I actually found this clip of Dustin Pedroia hitting in a cage just off of a batting tee. This is a couple spring trainings ago, um, but he's utilizing the batting tee. He's not taking batting practice, um, he's just using the tee. Now, I see a lot of younger players out there, they're kind of afraid of the tee, or they think that the batting tee is, you know, just for little kids that don't know how to hit. And it's amazing. You watch professional players every single day, uh, whether they're preparing for you know a spring training game or they're preparing for the World Series. Every single day, professional players hit off of a batting tee. So it's one of you know the greatest tools, greatest hitting devices out there. Some may call it old school, but it's great because you can work on hitting the ball, you know, in several different locations. And the batting tee should be your best friend. You know, it's never late, first of all, and it always throws strong strikes obviously and you can work the zone you know sometimes in batting practice um your coach might be you know pounding you in that day and so you don't get any work on the away pitch and so the batting tee is great because you can show equal love to different parts of the strike zone but anyway the reason why I call this the Pedroia series is because this is just a great video and a great camera angle showing him and exactly what he does, what his tea routine is. And I just wanted to walk you through it really quickly. Uh, found this clip on YouTube, like I said, and so let's start it off. As you can see, um, he's working on hitting the ball away, 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 away. You can see, notice where the tee is placed in relation to the plate. That is an away pitch, and where is he taking that ball? He's a right-handed hitter, so he's taking that ball to right field. So that's how he starts. He starts out, you know, the tee's pretty much belt high, and he's working on hitting the ball away. And as you'll see coming up here, right here, that's exactly how they're going to pitch him in games. So there's a pitch away. He stays through it a long time, hits it, uh, the ball to right field, base knock. Okay, so um, as you can see, his T work directly relates um, to how they're pitching him in a, in a game. And if you utilize the T effectively, you can really set yourself up for success. So now he's moving the T after you work away for a while about belt high. Now he's actually going to move the T in and back as you can see. It's not, you know, an in pitch where he's going out and getting it like a home run swing. This pitch right here actually resembles him kind of getting beat. Maybe, you know, he's got two strikes and he's thinking about an away pitch and trying to react in and the guy throws him a 97 mile an hour fastball or 98 mile an hour fastball and it's in and he's just trying to fight it off back up the middle for a base hit. So that's kind of what this uh, location of the tee simulates. You got beat a little bit and you're just trying to fight that ball off. As you can see, this is a really, really far uh, in in relationship to his, his hands and his body. Uh, he, he's getting beat, but watch what he does with the ball. Hits it right back up the middle and you'll see again this directly translates to the game here's a game 2-2 two -two count look at that pitch 96 miles an hour right back up the middle another one 3-2 count boom right back up the middle again 97 miles an hour and finally uh, this is the last T location um, in the Pedroia warm-up series now he's gonna move the T in and up and this simulates, you know, him having count leverage and him putting a really aggressive swing on the ball, um, you know, a pitch that's that's middle in uh, or uh, inside, and he's really, really going to turn on this pitch. And he's going deep sea fishing here. This is not a two-strike passive swing. This is something that's aggressive. Uh, he's going to hit the ball out in front of his body. And you can see this is, you know, these swings here, this is kind of more like let the big dog eat, okay? So it's still in, as you can see, but boom, he's working on hitting everything uh, left center. And you'll notice with all these swings, guys, He's not hitting the ball down the right field line on the away side, and he's not pulling the ball down the left field line. You want to work gap to gap, so left center gap to right center gap, and that's exactly what he's doing here. So he's letting the big dog eat, man. This is a, a hitter's pitch right here. And that allows him to do that in a game. Boom! Over the green monster. So if you want results like this on the field, then try the Pedroia warm-up series, guys. Uh, I really, really enjoy this. This is something that I do um, you know, on a pretty much a daily basis. I utilize this in my tee work. And again, you know... If, if you know a coach is pounding a certain location in batting practice and you know you, you just you, you uh, you're not getting equal love to each side of the strike zone 
then you're going to want to go back to the tee afterward and make sure that you show equal love to every single area. But the batting tee, guys, use it and you know consistently use it every single day because it's, I guarantee you it's going to make you a better hitter. So this is the Pedroia warm-up series.